Hi, I'm Marty Duda. Welcome to the 13th floor. We've got a couple of guys from The Nudge with us today. Uh, this is Ryan and this is James. Welcome, guys. Thanks, Marty. Good to be here. Yeah, you're a little worse for wear after the music awards last night. Is that correct? Yeah, totally. James, yeah. To explain why. Um, oh, we were, Ryan and I both work for um, Massey University and, and uh, Massey sponsors the Producers Award. And... Um, uh, we just had a big night, Marty. <laughs> you know, we we went quite large with the staff. I guess we're celebrating first year of students being in there, um, in that in that degree. Uh, so, you know, we we celebrated and and had a good time. Excellent. So, I'm, I'm yeah. glad you did. Yeah, you were there as well. I was indeed. Yep. I tried to behave myself as best I could. Yeah, it was a good night. Yeah, not quite enough food, but it was a good night. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. always the case. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, do you have any thoughts about the music awards in general? Do they mean anything to you, to a band like The Nudge? Mm, they're perhaps not relevant to us so much as a band. Right. Um, I don't know if we have the this, the type of music that is um, embraced by that sort of event. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, very good. So the reason that you're here in Auckland is you have a new video out. And That's you're right. kind of on tour. Yep. You're doing a show... Is it Whammy? Yep, Whammy yep. next Saturday, the 26th of November. And yep, with support from Dictaphone Blues. Very good. Yeah. Alrighty. And you're in the process of, well, you've recorded an album, and that's going to be out in February. That's so right. So it's a little odd to be out on the road before the album is out two months, two or three months before. Yeah, I guess that. this is to promote our, our video and our single. Um, there's only, only really one single on the album because it's a, um, a three track album. Um, and it's so not an EP. It's not an EP, no. The. Um, this this first song is um, is sort of the the shortest one the the most single worthy. This is um, and it's called dark it's arts. It's called dark arts. That's yeah. right. And um, yeah, the next track is is around, comes in around thirteen minutes, and then um, the last track is um, is the whole of side B on the vinyl, which which runs in at twenty four minutes. So it's a journey. Excellent. It's a journey of an album. Well, we've got a copy of the video. So what I thought we would do is we'll watch the video with you guys making kind of comments underneath, like like a DVD extra. Yeah, almost. cool. Okay, well, start off with Great Barrier Island. You know, we travelled up to Great Barrier and um, and and sort of an ancestral batch up there, um, and it's one of the most beautiful spots. And so I guess the start of the video is us travelling to this batch. And one of the features um, is all of the time-lapse footage that the video makers, uh, Mark and, and Sophie, uh, kind of, you know, spent um, weeks and weeks gathering some time-lapse footage of stars and clouds and oceans. Um, you should have waited for the supermoon. Yeah, <laughs> I know. Well, it was kind of during Matariki, so actually the absence of moon meant that the stars were... Um, the brightest of, of we've ever seen them, really, you know, in a way. Um, and who was directing the video? Uh, it was uh, Mark Russell and Sophie Reinholt uh, from Renegade Peach. Yeah. So there you can see some of the beautiful stars of Great Barrier Island. And uh, this is us um, conjuring up some dark arts from the fire. Are you guys into the dark arts? Some of them. Some of them? <laughs> some of them are into us. Yeah. There's some more beautiful time lapse of the uh, sunset on the Great Barrier. We really fell in love with that place. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah we did some, um, some green screen footage uh, down at Massey University. Um, so it was great to incorporate some of that into the, into the video. First time for us using some of that great technology. Okay. And that was just out from the batch, so we, you know, the batch was just just right there on the on the seashore. Some great dance moves going on there. Yeah, you guys are rocking it. <laughs> and there's um, James being the emperor from Return of the Jedi. Where we travel into another realm. (laughs) 
Almost looks like uh, from the man who fell to earth. The <laughs> Big thanks to Island Bay Dive Hire for, uh, for the wetsuits. It kept us cosy in the midwinter sea. This was a lot of fun filming this part. Um, you know, we were, we were sort of uh, apprehensive about jumping in the ocean at that time of year. <laughs> but um, it was actually really fun and the weather was beautiful. Um, which probably helped fall in love with that place. It's a little bit intense here with a nice build. Yeah, the underwater footage was, was, a, was a lot of fun to make, and um, yeah, I've got to say big ups to Sophie who spent a good hour or so under the water when we were jumping into a rock pool. Right. The scuba tank. Yeah. Yeah. There was an amazing rock pool there where it was like this um, at low tide, it was filled probably like, what, three meters deep? And um, sort of like a four meter diameter pool that was filled up that we um, were diving in and out. Love those special effects. Yeah, yeah there's some... So then, who edited it? Uh, Mark and Sophie and they had um, help from... Um, a guy called Owen. That's right, Owen um, to right. do all the special effects. And you guys kind of oversee it at all, or you just wait and see what they came up with? Um, they, they sort of did an initial edit, and yeah. then we um, gave them a few ideas, and, um, and they came back with, with the final edit. Right. Yeah, it was a really smooth process. To, um, you know, Going to the light. Yeah. <laughs> this is one of my favorite shots here, right at the end, with the... Um, this was in the rock pool, and then the, um, the silhouette there of one of us standing in front of the sun. Uh-huh. That yeah, looks very X-Files there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and the great horns of um, some, some great Wellington musicians blasting through. Well, that's pretty cool. So uh, yeah. uh, do you think it's going to get massive airplay? And oh, I think it's going to um, go viral, eh? Yeah. yeah world over. Yeah, yeah people are going to love it. Yeah, well, it's been out for a little while, so <laughs> have you gotten much reaction from it? Yeah, we've had a lot of great comments. Um, I think it's been out for a week now, or yeah. nearly a week, five days. So um, so not that long, really, but, um, you know, uh, our people are loving it so far, which cool. is awesome. Now, these shows that you're doing, are you doing the new album yet, or are you kind of We're holding doing, off on that? We're doing parts of it. Um, some of it we will probably hold off till February, mm -hmm. but um, we'll be playing Dark Arts for sure, and, um, and a sort of section of, of one of the other tracks. Um, but yeah, when, uh, the, the third track of, of the album will um, we'll, we'll save off till, till the album release. Cool. Mm. Well, I'm, I'm glad you guys made it over here. It's very cool to watch that and hear how it was put together. And so I'm looking forward to when the album is out, you're going to come up back up here and maybe do a little session. That'd be great. We'd That'd love be, to do that. Yeah. Shake up the rafters a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. good. All yeah. right. Well, thank you very much. Enjoy your time in Auckland. And we'll thank see you, you next time around. Cheers, mate.